We're about to head up to Napa Valley for the night. And little Toodles, poor little Toodles knows we're leaving, unfortunately. Rebecca's coming to watch her tonight. She'll get her toothbrush in the morning. You ready to hit the road, Jill? Bushes. You can stand out and sell a smaller family of. I just like to know what kind of wine you like and maybe what. I like dry wines. Dry, yeah, like yeah. dry reds or uh -huh. like mid whites. Like okay. not too sweet, not too dry. Okay. I'm not yeah. too okay. particular really though. I just like the yeah, same. Yeah, yeah. Some of them I just walk downtown. Okay. So you could yeah. get some of them just tasting room. Okay. Yeah. So that Cami is a tasting room downtown. This is the castle yes. that we have. Uh, which is fun to see because, I mean, I must say the guy who built this castle, he got the stone over from Europe and oh, wow. he had people come over and build it oh, from Italy. So it from it, it's pretty, it's pretty authentic. It feels old. That's okay. Awesome. So I was, I was impressed because it's not just like, you know, some set. Um, Piedmonte. We were in, um, Sicily. Oh, yeah. And then I've also been to like a mall for you. These look like some original like wood floors. Is this like just an LBP or is that real? I don't think it's LBP. <laughs> the super fancy stuff is in the bathroom. It has heated floors, which I have never personally experienced before. And also a heated toilet seat. You can set the temperature of the floor. Oh, you're gonna wear it? Yeah. Cool. Oh, and I love the shower, by the way, too. It's got this nice, super hot shower head, and then all these extra things. Don't leave me! Let me turn off the lights and save and conserve energy. Save and conserve energy. The game plan is we're gonna go to. This one, what's this? Chateau Montalena. Yeah, because it closes at four. And then this other castle one, because these ones you both have to drive to, and they're a little further away, and they close earlier. And then we'll explore this town, which is called what? Calistoga. Calistoga. They also have a shuttle. Yeah, the free that shuttle. you call, and they come and get you. So and it's like a taxi shuttle. Yeah. And these passports get you into like all these wineries around here. Yeah, it's 16 different wineries. Yeah. This is all included in the price of our hotel, it's like 300 bucks yeah. in the middle of January, which is off season. Right? Yeah, so the hotel was like 200 and these are 60 each, but we got like a package deal for 300 Let's go find the wine bushes.
Where's your passport? It's in my pocket. He's starting to get a little patina. <laughs> place is really neat. What's this one called? Castello di Did you just want to do the tasting that it covers? Yeah. Um, sure. I think so. Can do we have see? other options? Uh, you can upgrade to do the reserve tasting. Mm -hmm. Can I just see both sides, yeah. please? Yeah. Outside on the left, you can start. All okay. right. Big oh, Lieto. Big <laughs> We were just in Italy. <laughs> <laughs> we learned all that meant the hard way. <laughs> Bigelieto. This place feels like very authentic. That's what she said. Yes. Uh, the Bigelieto. Go to the rest of the tour. Okay. Um, the tower, sorry, left for the tastings. Okay. Alright. This place is very neat. I question and wonder about importing all of this material straight from Italy. Is that like correct? <laughs> like, seems like a sh load of weight to bring from across the world. We have rocks here. Maybe this is like the same thing they did with the Egyptian pyramids. It's just like a wine tasting thing. They had their, their stone imported from like really far away, you know? It's like, seems unnecessary. I don't really care where we go here. This place seems pretty awesome. Oh yeah, the tower is busy. I would take a picture with you in here. Okay. But we don't have to if you want. I want to. Right. We're going to the tower because everybody just left the tower to go where we were standing. Because we look so cool, obviously. So we Yeah, I mean, we could see this place from there. That is where we are. decided to upgrade to try all of the reserved wines. We have the rosé right now. What was it, $15 to upgrade? Yeah, it's yeah. Each, but we're splitting one. Yeah, splitting. Because they're cheap and bougie. <laughs> but not bad and bougie. 
I really like that. Yeah, it's good. What'd you get? I got flies. <laughs> Wine teeth. Just a little bit. Giant FedEx just blocking the view. I guess they need to get all these wine barrels in here somehow. Look at this. So meta. Bought a bottle. Buy a bottle, get a calendar. You get a can a calendar anyway. <laughs> Doesn't seem like quite a deal then. This one's not quite as glamorous of an entrance. <laughs> I mean, it's like, it's neat. I would have been more impressed if this was the first place we went. We get these tokens to ride the trams up to the top. This is going to be the oatmeal chardonnay. When you try this, you're going to get notes of apple, apricot, and peach. Hey, good. How you doing? Not too bad. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Hey! What's wrong with you? There you go. So when you guys try this, this is going to be the oatmeal district chardonnay. I don't want to sound like a robot, so I'm not going to say what's there. <laughs> Lots of barrels. Grape juice barrels. 
That looks fancy. So this is a very light and small Merlot. You don't get lots of blackberry, black cherry and plums. And this one goes really well with uh, any white meat, uh, chicken or... Okay. I like chicken. <laughs> <laughs> and you can like find it in the stores. Okay. okay. Yeah, I have seen that one before. Have you? Is that a camera? Yeah. <laughs> tiny camera. Huh? Yeah, it's a tiny camera. <laughs> does it take good pictures? Yeah, it's yeah. really good for like, video. Oh, um, okay. okay. So it's like a, it's, go it's called a GoPro. GoPro? Uh -huh. It's like a wow. sports camera. So uh -huh. like, if you're like skiing or oh, riding out, uh -huh. or like, I think she likes scuba to scuba diving. Dive oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like, that little thing's tough. You can like wow. throw it on the ground. Oh, really? Fine. Nothing happens to it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I like this. Yeah. yeah, me too. She might be the only person I've ever encountered that doesn't know what a GoPro is mm -hmm. in 2020. I have a 2016 Cabernet Sauvignon for you here. Right. Here you go. And where are you folks visiting from? We are from Indianapolis, but we're living in Fresno for three months. Oh, so. uh, nursing? Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Yeah, we, we get that uh, here and there once in a while. Yeah. There you go. And that one shorted you a little bit. There you go. <laughs> Sorry, he's driving. He's oh, oh okay. Well, you can <laughs> give her some uh, if you like. <laughs> Thank okay, you. Okay, you're welcome. Yes, good looking hat. Okay. So I'm gonna like hat. put this on tomorrow and be like, I bought that when I was wine drunk. <laughs> <laughs> so the lady asked me if I was a basketball player <laughs> in my quick wit from my wine told I told her I was a sumo wrestler and she totally bought it. She's like, Oh yeah. I thought you were so good at yeah. that. She's like, Of course you were a sumo wrestler. <laughs> I'm like 6'5 and I weigh like 50 pounds. Cheers. That was a slow, long cheers. Pro tip when wine tasting in Napa Valley. Pro tip. Bring Chick-fil-A cookies. Oh yeah. Eat Chick-fil-A before you go.
Brennan Inn. Is that what this is called? Brennan Inn? Brennan Inn. Brennan Inn. Put your head on. Put your head on. The Brennan Cottage Inn, which has been a nice day. We're leaving Calistoga right now and we're going to pass through San Francisco on the way back to Fresno. 